Okay, money making apps. A quick search on the App Store reveals a never ending list of apps promising to pay, whether it's surveys, games, or literally just walking. <sighs> so, in this video, I'm going to spend eight hours straight using a bunch of these different apps and answer the burning question in all of our heads, are these apps a scam? Now, I've seen creators like Beer Hezer do this challenge and this was his idea, so full credits to him. But it has been a few months since I've seen anyone do this and a lot of new money apps have been popping up all over the place. So I thought I would give this a try and see if we can make that break. So the plan is this. Today, I will spend four hours straight using the most popular money-making apps with the most reviews and total up how much we make. And then tomorrow, I will spend another four hours using the less popular apps which don't have as many reviews and see the difference in how much we get paid. In my head, I am thinking that maybe the apps with less downloads will pay better, just so that they can be more competitive with the more popular apps, but we are just going to have to wait and see about that one. Now, before I officially clock in, I'm going to quickly look on my phone and the app store and figure out exactly what apps we're going to use, just so that I don't have to waste any time in looking for the apps and we can get an accurate representation of how much I actually make. Okay, so I have done a quick search of money making on the app store and the first result is an app called Make Money Earn Easy Cash, which we are obviously going to go ahead and download because what are we here for? Easy cash. <laughs> okay, what else? Zap surveys, 1.6 thousand reviews, download it. Cash for steps make real money by walking. Judging by what this type of app is, I really don't think we're gonna make anything by walking. This is probably one of those apps where if you walk a 50 mile marathon, you get a total of three cents. And I'm not sure if you guys have seen my chicken legs. <laughs> But these babies are not walking a marathon anytime soon. Now, I have kept scrolling for a little while and the only ones that were really popping out was the Make Money app and the Zap Surveys app. So, I think in the four hours of day one, I am going to spend two hours each on these apps and see how that goes. So, let us officially clock in for our first four hour shift and I will obviously keep you guys updated throughout this four hours. So, let's go take a seat on a more comfy chair, grab some scrumptious money making snacks and get into this okay it is currently 12 p.m. and I'm going to clock in for my first four hours of day one I'm going to be using the first app which is literally just called make money so I'm going to spend the next few hours grinding away on this app <laughs> I literally don't even know what it is I don't know if it's surveys or anything I have no clue but I'm going to start the clock jump in this app create an account do all of that and hopefully start making some money okay so after creating an account, signing up and reading how it all works, I realized that this app in particular was a task-based app where you complete tasks like downloading apps, playing levels and things like that in order to get credits which you can eventually redeem for real cash. Okay, so I opened the app and I got 30 free credits and I just completed the check-in task where I literally clicked a button and it has given me another 20 credits. I have no idea how many dollars that actually equates to, but it says want to earn more credits by watching a short video. And as you know, we are on the clock for eight hours. So free money from a short video sounds pretty good to me. So let's click yes. Mine crypto on my phone for free. I want that. Two credits. Okay, let me try and find out how much I can... 5,000 credits for $5. Oh my God, you are kidding me. Just for a bit of background context, I have been doing dropshipping and building websites and all of that stuff for three years now. And I have been lucky enough now to make a full-time income strictly online through things like Shopify dropshipping. So I'm super grateful for that. But sitting here and seeing that I need 5,000 credits to literally pay out $5 is pretty disheartening. I'm not going to lie. But we are here and this is a challenge. So we're not going to give up. I'm just going to sit here for a few hours and see how many credits I can get. And hopefully we will at least hit that 5 5,000 credits mark. So let's see how we go. 
So I sat there and scrolled through the entire task list on the app and I realized the one thing that all of these tasks have in common. So it says I can get 5,210 credits for literally downloading a solitaire game. I feel like this might be one of those apps that just has tasks to try and get you addicted to like casino games and that sort of thing. So from the first 15 minutes of using this app, I am definitely getting scam vibes from this and I'm not feeling too good about it so far, but I might try and complete a few quick tasks before giving up on this app and moving on to the surveys one. So, after one whole hour of looking through each individual task and trying to find the best one, I was completely stuck. The tasks didn't require you to only download an app, but also required you to play through it and complete numerous levels, which meant that each individual task would take hours to complete with a very small reward. Alrighty, so I have come across a task on the app which says that I need to download an app called Harvest Land and reach level 20 through playing the game. It says if I reach level 20, it will pay me out 2,605 credits, which will put us well on our way to that 5,000 and that $5 PayPal transfer, which we desperately want. Please just give me the $5. So I'm going to try and download Harvest Land, see how long it takes me to reach level 20, and we will hopefully get our credits. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and do you guys a favor and not put in the footage of me spending two hours playing that Harvest Land game because that was... Yeah, that wasn't good. I spent nearly two hours using that game and I am pretty sure I only got up to like level seven or something like that, but I literally had no clue what was going on. Safe to say I was definitely not going to keep playing that game, especially until I reached level 20 just to earn 2000 credits. So thankfully I stopped playing that app and I called it a day. Don't worry though, the challenge is not over. We still have another four hours left to grind and I am not stopping here. If you saw the challenge I did on my channel where I started with one cent and tried to turn that into $1,000 strictly online, you would know that there are much better ways to make money online than using these apps. If I remember correctly, we ended up turning that one cent into nearly $1,200. That leaves us with a grand total to end episode three at $1,182. Let's go! Through things like Shopify dropshipping and freelancing and some other stuff. So definitely go and watch that if you want to watch a challenge which is actually successful because I am definitely losing hope about this one. Now, just quickly before I move on to the next app, please go ahead and invest into the like button down below because like I just said, this challenge is not going well and I need all the good luck I can possibly get. So smash that shit. Anyway, with the last four hours of this challenge, I'm going to keep hustling just to make sure that I don't walk out of this challenge with zero dollars. So the next app that I'm going to be trying is what I talked about earlier called Zap Surveys. Okay, it is now day two. I know that I said we have four hours left, but I was wrong and we actually have close to five hours left. So I'm going to create an account on Zap Surveys and start grinding away on this app. So that is exactly what I did. I created an account and was welcomed with a very nice surprise. Okay guys, so right off the bat, I open the app and it says I've been zapped and I have a new survey ready. And it says I can make $6.25 from a four minute survey. So straight away, this app is about a million times better than the last one. So I'm going to click begin survey and see how this goes. So I spent about five minutes filling out that survey and sure enough, we got our money. $6.25 had been credited into our account and I was ready to keep going. So I kept going, filling out as many surveys as I possibly could until I was finally finished. Okay. I just did so many surveys that I actually learned how to teleport. My sanity is like this Tic Tac box. One tiny little bit left. I can safely say that I never want to fill out another survey or use any of these apps again, but I can also say that I come with some good news. We made some money.
I spent literally hours doing surveys, talking about my buying patterns, what I buy from the grocery store, what type of industry I work in, literally everything like that, earning between five and 10 cents per survey that I complete. I was actually really lucky because I never ran out of surveys. I hear that most people who use these apps do a few surveys and then get told that they aren't eligible to do any more. But for me, I don't know if it's my location or my age or whatever it is, but I was eligible for so many surveys and I never ran out. Anyway, enough of that. Let's cut to the chase. How much did we make? Cue the suspenseful music because we made $13.42. Let's go! After about eight hours, my total earnings for these apps came out to about $13, which really isn't great. Comparing it to the one cent to $1,000 challenge I did, which I talked about earlier, after day one of that challenge, I'm pretty sure we had already made about $200. So there are definitely much better ways to make cash where you don't have to fill out these surveys and play the games and do all that. All in all though, I am glad to say that we didn't come out with nothing, but it is also safe to say that I will not be hopping on any of those apps in my spare time. Now, if you have any actual questions about how to make money online, dropshipping, finance, anything you want, go ahead and send me a DM on Instagram at EcomBaxter. As most of you know, I reply to every single DM which I get over on Instagram and I love talking to you guys. So definitely send me a message. Also, if you enjoyed this video and want to see my terrible haircut again, go ahead and smash the subscribe button with notifications on so you don't miss out on what we do next. For now, that's all from me, but I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.